Okay, so you guys do offer a sign-on bonus, but it's paid out in in six-month increments. Right, starts after thirty days and it splits over six months. Yes. All right, so a driver such as myself will be at fifty-four cent. What will be what will be the other what will be the other uh, pay that I would get? Like, what what is tarpon pay? Do uh, I or I do I get paid? For, I'm sorry. Go ahead. Yeah, I love the seventy. I low for seventy five percent pre tarp. If you have to do any tarping, oh, you pay an extra twenty five dollars. All you have to do is stay a minute, just take your time. The clock is ticking, so stay. All you have to do is stay. What's up, everybody? Lockout Man here, back again with another podcast for you guys. I am Lockout Man, and welcome back to the Lockout Man podcast show, the MTC edition. And for you guys that don't know what MTC means, it means make the call. You know, I I, I got this series called Lockout Man Makes the Call. Uh, four years strong, four seasons. Uh, you could check the playlist in the uh, in the YouTube uh, in the YouTube wherever you can find me, but uh, I abbreviate it. Um, I abbreviate it down and just made it and just called it the MTC edition. You guys hook me up with these calls to make to these companies. You suggested them. You want you want to know more about it. You support the you you support me in doing it. So let me just go and say this uh, right quick. You want me to make a call, that's all well and fine. I don't have a problem doing that. I love doing it. I like getting information. I like to hear what other companies have to, you know, have to offer. And I like to see what type of interaction that I can get with the recruiters, you know, to see if if they're honest, if they're just, you know, sugar footing or whatever. You know what I'm saying? But I want to let you know that this does take time. It does take a lot of research, you know what I'm saying? Because the same thing that I am doing is what you should be doing. You should be doing the same thing that I'm doing, taking the time, researching the company, seeing that this is right for you. You see what I'm saying? So hook a brother up for, I mean, with some coffee, man, because I am not number one. I am not sponsored, but I would, what I'm going to do in the next episode, I am going to start mentioning an app that's on your phone a app that's on your phone and you can um you can um you can um st- uh, you <laughs> okay let me get my thought together you can use this app to you know locate any uh driving jobs out there and i will start be mentioning that uh in the next episode but well in this episode we who are we going to talk about, Lockout Men? Lockout Men. Who, who are we going to who who are we going to talk about? Well, I, I I'm going to tell you who we're going to talk about. We are going to talk about. We're going to talk about this company right here. We're going to talk about. We're going to talk about McElroy. Truck Lines. They're located out of Cuba, Alabama. I want to say that's Alabama. I'm not sure. But, uh, you know, to go over this uh, company before we get into the call, let's uh, let's see what they got. They they guarantee home every Friday. You know, I already talked to the young lady. Uh, company drivers at McElroy, they got a steady stream of freight waiting for, for you. They primarily haul, I mean, they primarily haul building products with 75% of the loads already tarped. But if you want, you know, you do get paid for a tarp if you got a tarp it. You're home every Friday. They got late model tractor trailers. They run all regional and local loads. So I'm from Ohio, so they definitely got something for me. But if you're from other states, they do hire out of other states. And they try to keep you within a region of your home so that they can actually get you home Friday. You got permanent assigned trucks, 2,000 watts inverters, 66 mile per hour on the cruise, and free rider program. Now, 66 miles may not be that fast, but considering the fact that you get paid, fit, well, for me, I would get paid 54 cents a mile. That might be considered something. 
here's their pay scale. They got they got this on their website, by the way, which is drivemtl.com, drivemechelroy.com. Uh, your pay for regional and local was six months is 45, regional is 49, but if you got three years plus, you'll be getting 49 and you'll be getting 53. Now, she told me 54. I'm not sure if that's accurate or not. Uh, great pay, you average about $700 weekly minimum. Now, that is because of the, uh, the miles. Now, you might not it's 1700 miles on average and like i said before that's pretty much not no money you figure if 700 dollars is gross pay then your take home pay is going to be a lot less so again do your research and see if this works for you you get a two thousand dollar sign-on bonus for experienced drivers a thousand dollar sign-on bonus that's paid out in six months uh vacation eight paid holidays minimum pay per load layover pay breakdown pay yada 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 pay gi bill pay yada 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 pay weekly deposits 75 preload tarps you get 25 dollars the tarp and 66 dollars per diem per day they got insurance don't have to go over that and then of course you know the requirements you got to be 21 years old have an excellent driving record pass a dot physical and must have a professional appearance. I'm not sure what they exactly mean by that, but give them a call to find out. So let's see what Mick Elroy Trucking got to offer for us. Let's get into the call. Hi, how you doing today? Um, are you, are, you are a recruiter, right? Yes. Oh, okay. Yes. Okay. Cool. Cool. My name's uh, my name's Sean, and um, I'm doing uh, some research on some trucking companies out here now. Uh, I was talking to you know some of my driver friends inside of my Facebook group, and uh, how do you pronounce the name? Mac Elroy. That's correct. Yes. Oh, okay. Mac Elroy. All right. You guys are you guys are a a, a flatbed company, right? Or do you guys do uh, more than just flatbed? We are only a flatbed company. Oh, okay, okay. Um, well, if you don't mind, uh, you know, if you got a little bit, I I like to learn a little bit more about the company, if I may. Okay. Um, may I send you a link to our website that way you can read about our company? Um, I'm, I'm on the website now. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, okay. So, yeah, what specific uh, questions yeah. do you have? Do you have a class A CDL? Are you in truck driving school? Uh, I I have a class A CDL. Yes, and no, I'm not in truck driving school. I'm I'm a five year veteran uh, out here, but I do oh, have great. do I I do have uh, a little bit of questions pertaining uh pertaining to your training. Do you guys train? Uh, do you guys have like a CDL school for? For drivers that don't have CDLs, um, no, we do not. We, oh, um, did, okay. But when the virus started, that program was discontinued. So no, we do not. Ooh, coronavirus just came and hit everything, turned everything around, huh? That is very correct. <laughs> you guys, but do you, you guys, you guys do train drivers that come out of CDL school, though, right? That is correct, yes. Okay, 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 okay. Um, on that note, on that quick question, right quick, uh, before I get into a specific question, um, do they get do they get paid while they're training, like the tarping? Do they get paid like a CPM or do they get paid like a flat rate or how? Okay, how so you calling from? Huh? You're calling from Ohio? Yes. You're calling from Ohio? Yes. Okay, yeah. Drivers get paid all of the training and orientation. Yes. Each week of training and orientation, drivers are paid uh, $750. Mm -hmm. Our drivers uh, start at 50 cents per mile. We top out at 54. Okay. Now, you say all drivers. That's including me with a five-year uh, five experience? No, with five years experience, do you have flatbed or what type of trailer have you been pulling? Uh, I pulled drive-in, uh, reefer, and tankers. 
Okay, so with our company, you would qualify for what we call this as expedited driver. It means you're an experienced driver, so you would have to come to orientation for two weeks. That first week will be orientation. Orientation pays $1,000. That second week will be yard training, low securement carbon, also pays $1,000. And you would be at about 50, you get 54 cents per mile. That also comes with a $1,000 sign on bonus that starts after 30 days. In the split of six months. What will be what will be the other what will be the other uh, pay that I would get? Like what what is tarpon pay? Do uh, I or do I get paid? I'm sorry. Go ahead. Yeah, I low for seventy. I low for seventy five percent free tarp. If you have to do any tarpon, uh, you pay an extra twenty five dollars. Okay. Um, do you guys offer anything like percentage pay, or is it all CPM? Per mile, yes. Oh, okay, okay. So, what is the average? What is the average miles per week that I can get? Uh, right now, on average, it's about seventeen up to twenty five hundred, maybe more or less. That all depends on the driver. Okay, so this is you say seventeen. So I'm thinking this is more regional than over. I mean, than uh, OTR. Correct, yes. We are a regional company. Home on the weekends, we ride our drivers home on Friday. Monday's delivery determines what time you leave on Sunday. Oh, okay, 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 awesome. All right, so even if I'm even if I'm from Ohio, I would still get home on a Friday? Correct, yes. Okay, so I, I'm, I'm assuming the way that it works, what might work for me, that I will pick up a load that will deliver – on Monday in order for me to be home for that weekend, correct? That's about correct, yes. Okay, 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 okay. Um, so during orientation, uh, you said it's a span of two weeks. The one week will be securement training. Uh, would that be, would I still need some flatbed experience? Or Yes, because you do not have, um, you said you have not full flatbed. Mm -hmm. So yes, you would have to do some flatbed, yes. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Um, so what about all right? So during orientation, what 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 is the pre? Um, what is the what I call it the the pre stuff like you know like drug uh, drug tests and stuff like that? Is it hair follicles? Because I read somewhere that you guys do hair follicles, but I I want to make sure that. So is it hair follicles or is it urine or both? We do both, a hair follicle and a urine. Hair follicle is very detailed. It goes back up to a year. Wow. So what a so being that you guys do both, what if what if somebody comes in that that they can't extract hair from? Like uh, then you would be sent home. Uh, that would be company policy, uh, because you have to do a hair follicle to test. Hair follicle, uh, the sample that we have is like about the size of a cotton ball. Oh, okay. So you would have to do the hair follicle drug test also. Oh, okay. 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 All right. Um, what kind of what what kind of trucks do you guys have? What 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 uh what the equipment that you guys uh have for us? Okay. Our fleet is about three years old. We changed them out so they try to keep everything rotated. About three years old. We have automatic vehicles and manuals. Right now we about half and half. Uh, international LT 2018, so those all automatic vehicles. We have a few international co-stars, um, 10 feet. Uh, those are probably 17s, and some Freightliner Cascadia. Those also 17s. Okay. Can we choose? Uh, can we choose what truck that we want to drive? As far as uh, a manual, or or we just have to go with what's available. Okay, unless you have a Class A restriction on your Class A, our safety department, they will road test you in a 10 feet, and they make the decision if you better suit it for an automatic or a manual. Oh, okay, okay. Pet and rider policy? Um, no pet policy, and anyone over 15 can ride with you over after 90 days. Okay, do we got So, may I take some contact information from you, and I can send you a link to our website. I think you said you're already on the yeah, website. Yeah, I'm on I'm I'm on the website. <laughs> so that's why that's where majority of my questions is coming from. <laughs> okay. Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh that's where majority of my questions is 
is uh is coming from you know it's sort of like getting it's sort of like getting clarification pretty much you know what i'm saying okay. uh you know okay. it's you know a lot of a lot of companies put on their websites sometimes they don't update their where they websites so that's why you know i i call and try to get the more information myself the bet the better i know about the company the better i can make my decisions as far as you know choosing uh what company i want to you know want to eventually transfer to or you know go with so um you know i'm basically like looking for stability you know a lot of companies don't offer that you know especially for uh, a five-year driver such as myself you know a lot of company don't don't offer that so i was just you know trying to see what McElroy can offer me as far as stability goes uh, we are a solid based company a christian based company we have been around since i think about the 60s uh, we have a lot of drivers that have been with the company for a very long time um, you know, in trucking company, companies, you can always have um, driver turnover. But for the most part, we have uh, happy drivers. We do keep our drivers busy. Um, I've asked, been asked this question a couple of times this morning as far as what winter time uh, right around the corner. But during the time our drivers still rolling, uh, we have not had a slow period. We have not slowed down any. Uh, during the peak of the virus, um, we were you know, very small classes, but now we're right back up to full capacity. Okay, okay. What what type of freight that that we will be haul, well, if I decide to come over, what, what type of freight that I will be hauling flatbed? All building materials. Oh, okay. And again, I know you. I, I know you know that you told me. I think you told me that you are regional. So, what areas that you guys run? Okay, our drivers are no ride no more than within a 500, 700 mile radius from where you live. Uh, we do not ride our drivers no farther than uh, at any time about 12 hours away from home. Uh, that way, you know, it's easy for us to get you back home on Friday. That's how we can guarantee home on the weekend. Okay, okay. Any any northeast? Anything up in the northeast? Uh, we little a little bit of the southeast, southwest, midwest, and mid Atlantic states. Okay. And then again, before you know, I my last couple of questions. Uh, you, you, Are you sure? Yeah, I'm positive. <laughs> you sure? Yeah, I'm, I'm uh, okay. I'm, I'm positive. Uh, that you, was a look. That was a joke. Okay. 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 Uh, <laughs> you did say you, you you did say I did tell you that I was that I was out of Ohio. So you guys you guys do hire uh, out of Ohio and other states as well, right? Or do y'all have a, a restriction to where you guys hire out of? No, Ohio is in our hiring area. Okay, okay. Uh, last question: What's your policies on uh, what's your policies on misdemeanors, fel uh, drivers with felonies, and drivers with uh, with uh, DWIs? Okay, a DWI has to be at least uh, five years old. You can only have a history of one. DUI, DWI, reason being, um, you know, we look at it if you were ever involved in an accident. A uh, lawyer can say you hired him and you know he had a history of DUI, DWI, something to that effect. So only one. Um, it has to be at least five years old. Felonies, misdemeanors, as long as you're not on any kind of probation, parole, everything is looked at on an individual basis. Okay. All right. Cool. Awesome. Uh what about drivers that don't have their high school diplomas? Does that make any difference? Not a problem. Okay, awesome, awesome. Well, thank you very much. I, I'm, I'm going to take this information with me. I'm going to. Uh, well, I feel like I, I feel like I know you. I see. I've been on the phone twelve minutes, so I am really looking for an application from you. <laughs> thank you very much. Well, I'm going to go ahead and take this information. I'm going to go ahead and um, I'm going to go ahead and uh, take this information with me, go over it, send it off, you know, share it with some of my guys in my group, you know, that might be interested in you guys as well. So, uh, but thank you very much for for the time, though. 
All right, great. You have a wonderful day. Hey, you too now. Thank you. McElroy, everybody. So what do you guys think of that call right there? Mech Elroy Truck Lines. What do you guys think of that call right there, man? Uh, she was she was pretty much honest and you know gave a little bit of information. I think she I think she was pretty much forward with all the questions that I had. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you know, just the just the basics, you know, and not trying to keep them on like a whole conversation you know what i'm saying i'm just trying to keep it short keep it sweet and get the information out there to you guys you know what i'm saying mech elroy so if you guys uh want to consider mech elroy uh truck lines you can give them a call at 800-992-8 i mean wait let me start over eight hundred nine nine two seven eight six three and uh you can call them up and uh chop it up with them and see if it's uh see if it's a good company for you this is a regional flatbed company that gets you home every friday every friday that's i think that's a promise that they can keep now i was kind of i was kind of missed i was kind of a meh i was like meh on the fact that she said 1,700 miles. And I was like, whoa, so there ain't no money. You know what I'm saying? 1,700 miles. But she clarified that by being a regional company. And that's how they're able to get you home on Fridays. This, this might be, uh, you know, for a flatbedder. You know, I'm, I'm, hey, look, you know, I'm, flatbed is a young man's game, in my opinion. But, but for the guys that want to get out there and do the damn thing, you know, I, I, this, this, this might work for you. This might work for you. You will get test out in a 10-speed, though. So if you have auto restrict, with the exception of auto restrictions, which I suggest you guys try not to get, whatever you do, try not to have that on your license. But they will test you out in a... In a, in a manual, but if you, of course, you know, you can't drive the manual, then they will eventually put you in the automatic. Now, the amenities, of course, I didn't go over that with her, but I'm going to assume that they have some good amenities in the truck. You know what I'm saying? So uh, I also didn't mention, I didn't ask about the driver camera, but I'm looking at this picture right here showing that they have some type of camera system in their trucks so if you're not a fan of that then you might not want to go well what do you guys what do you guys think uh make elroy truck lines and they're located out of cuba alabama i think that's cuba alabama al is alabama right cuba alabama well if you guys is interested let me know in the comments below uh that's it for this episode of lockout men in a podcast the mtc edition if you like content like this and more don't forget to like subscribe comment share and hit that bell and that all button for more if you want to suggest any of the companies that you want to call yo you can do that leave that in the comments below leave it in the email leave it in the dm let me know who you want me to call Support your boy in doing this because all the research, all the calls, and all that other good stuff that I do for you guys, YouTube do not pay for it, and this is not sponsored. All right, so if you want to hook me up and help me out, yo, you can do that. Hook me up with a coffee, you know what I'm saying? That's the coffee app in the description below, or the cash app, dollar sign, lock out me. You can do that, man. Hook a brother up. This is work. I do this on my I do this on my free time for you. I have to do it, but I like doing it for you guys. All right, give you the information that you want out here. Um, if you have any questions that you want me to ask these recruiters, leave it in the comments below. I would like to go back and uh, and shout out to the people that was in the comment section of the last video, which was CLE Transportation Company. 
great conversation. Definitely check out that video. You got to check out that video because the conversation between me and the recruiter, well, she she's not even a recruiter. She's actually, now she's, now she's a fan of the show and now she's part of the LOM community. So welcome. I would like to shout out Christopher Rick Bontant. Bunt, I can't pronounce your last name, sorry, sorry. He says, great company to work for. Max are automatics, Western Stars are 13 speeds. Been with them for eight months now. Run the Western Star OTR. Jay Smooth said, he supported me with some coffee for the call. Thank you very much. Alex Dawn says, her mom rocks. And Real Still says, she is a real one. So if you guys want to get shout out in the next video, make sure you leave your comments in the comments below. Let me know what you think about these calls that I'm doing for you, all right? So until next time, I appreciate you guys watching. I appreciate you guys listening. And on that note, I'm about to get on up out of here. You guys take it easy and have a beautiful best. Have a be had a be have a beautiful blessed day. Until the next MTC. This is Lockout Man, and I'm out.